Well, Joss, I want to stay to stick to the positives. How pleased were you to be back on the pitch tonight? Yeah, obviously it's um, it's a positive for me. Obviously, first game back in eleven or so months, but it's not about me. It's about the team tonight, and I think we know that it's not good enough. It was it was a crap performance, and um, yeah, we're accountable for for our performance tonight, and we know that it weren't good enough. For the standards that have been set so far this season by the group, that fell well short of it, didn't it? Yeah, the boys have worked really hard. Um, I know results have not always gone our way during the season, but the boys have always give 100% no matter what. And I feel, um, yeah, our standards, we just dropped short of our standards tonight. And um, the fans deserve better. Um, everyone deserves better. And we're going to do our utmost to rectify that on the weekend. To come here against a side that haven't won in 11 as well, we knew what they were going to be you know, throwing at us. They're going to be hungry to go and get that, that first win, like I say, in 11. And they just looked like they wanted it a bit more tonight. Yeah, that's the way it seemed um, for me as for me as well. Uh, we've been that team that hadn't won in a few games um, a couple of weeks ago, so we know what it takes and um, fair play to them. They come out fighting. I think the game was pretty even up until the first goal. And then, yeah, I'm uh, not sure what happened out there, but... Um, like I say, we're going to be doing everything we can to put it right for the fans on the weekend. Fairly uncharacteristic of the group to concede goals from set pieces as well, so that'll be something that's you know, frustrating in the dressing room as well. Yeah, definitely. The boys at the back, uh, Hayden, Donny, um, Manny have been superb, and Owen, the keeper. And um, yeah, it was unlike, uh, unlike us today for whatever reason, but we all have them days. Um, we've all had them before, we're all going to have them again. It's just how we respond to that now. That long road to recovery culminates in a, you know, an appearance for you this evening. How sweet is it a moment? I know the result's not gone away, but for you to get back out there and get that shirt back on your back. Yeah, it's nice. It's been, um, been a long time coming. Um, been back in training with the boys for a little while now, so it's, it's been really nice. I um, feel like half a footballer again, but um, yeah, I've still got a long way to go. Like I say, it's not about me. I wish the, the, um, my appearance was in under different circumstances, but hopefully there'll be a few more to come by the end of the season. A word on the um, medical staff for you, Ellie, Ewan, Dan McRae, Pryor and then Callum now. They've worked incredibly hard with yourself to get you back to this point. Yeah, Ellie, Callum's been brilliant since he's come in. Um, Ewan, um, all been brilliant with me. Uh, it's been a long, long road. I had lots of ups and downs, but hopefully it's been worth it. And if you work hard, it, it genuinely pays off. On a final note, uh, 301 travelling tonight. Their support's been fantastic, hasn't it? Yeah, and no, I appreciate all the supporters that come down. Made the long trek from uh, Walsall tonight. Apologies on the performance, but um, yeah, hopefully we can put it right and give them something to cheer about on the weekend.